All right, welcome to the very first Grizz Vision of the 2016-17 track and field campaign. I'm here with the head track and field coach, Paul Rice. Paul, we're down here in Fort Wayne. Had uh, some good performances, some good team performances. Go ahead and let's start with the women's side. What are your thoughts on, on how the women did today? Well, uh, you know, a lot of hard work went into this fall, and we were looking for some great start performances to the season uh, today. And uh, the women went 5-0 and as a team. We beat every team we went up against head-to-head -to -head today with the team scoring. Uh, I don't know if we've ever done that before to meet, so it's a great start for us. Uh, we had some freshman performances that were really great today with uh, Chanel Gardner uh, winning two events with the 200 and the 400. Uh, we had Sammy Mondry winning the 3K. Those are a couple standout performances. Uh, had a few PRs here and there, but more, more importantly, probably uh, a higher starting standards than we've had in the past in our first meet. A lot of the athletes are picking up almost where they left off last year. Moving forward, that's, that's the goal every year. On the men's side, same thing, 4-0. Uh, we were undefeated on the, on the men's side uh, today, which I don't know if we've ever done that in a meet before, in a dual meet format like this. Uh, we had some great individual performances from uh, one of our freshmen, Zach Sidnika, who won the uh, pole vault on a jump off with his teammate, and then also won the hurdles today. Uh, George O'Connor and uh, Jack, uh, Jake Bowman tied in the 3K for first place. Just some great performances overall. We're really excited moving forward and uh, got another one next week. Well, that, that's our kick cue. Us out of here. That's our cue to get out of here. So thanks a lot, Coach. We'll see you next month at uh, Central Michigan. All right, thanks.